Hi everyone, welcome to NetSet OS. So up till here, we have seen how to make a login page. If you forget your password, how you can go for it, as well as you can register here. Now, if you want to authenticate using Facebook, how we can do that? We will see now over here. So for that, we have a very beautiful site with the name developers.facebook.com. And here we need to go to create app. Here it will ask for manage business integration, integrate a third party gaming app for, will take forever. Here it will ask for display name. I'll give, let's say, NetSet OS learning. Um, NetSet OS e-learning. And here it will ask your email ID. I'll give mine netset os at the rate gmail.com then create app ID here it will confirm whether the person who is logging in is not a robot you need to check it out submit and here we have our dashboard for this Facebook for developers. Now here we got Facebook login set up audience network here you can give your messenger instant games you can go for anything which you want. Now I'm here for Facebook login. So here I'll go for setup. Remember you have this app ID which will be in use afterwards. So what I'll do I'll open a new notepad and we'll copy this app ID and here I need to go for Facebook login setup here it will ask for to get started which platform would I like here I want web then site URL here I'll give it triple zero rest I need to skip out next or you can do next now the next you'll go to settings here in basic you'll find an app id which i have already copied here the same app id as well as this app secret key here you need to copy app id and app secret now after this we will go to pycharm see in the last we have made certificate so he side bookmarks and here first of all I need to write in apostrophe social social underscore core dot backends dot Facebook dot Facebook o auth 2 and afterwards down below i'll write social or facebook key here i need to give the same key in apostrophe and then secret for secret you can give your own secret and here i have given my app id as well as secret key now after this I'll go here if you come down below it will ask for app domains here I'll give mine netsetos.org here you can give your app icon now after this I'll save the changes then I'll go to Facebook login settings Make sure this client OAuth login, web OAuth login and force HTTPS and embedded browser OAuth should be yes. Then I'll come down and here we need to give valid OAuth redirect URLs. Here I need to give the login page where it should redirect to. So for me, I'll give HTTPS netsetos.org triple zero social auth complete facebook 
and then I'll save all changes. Now I need to make some changes in the login. I'll go to PyCharm, inside account, templates, registration, I have my login.html. Now before this end block, I'll make a div class where I'll give social. Inside this, I'll make ul for an order and inside ul, I'll give li class which will be Facebook. Now inside this, I need to give a link href url social begin space in quotes Facebook and then I'll end this and here and here I'll give this statement sign in with Facebook here we will have the login for Facebook here I'll give space so after this we will go to Chrome HTTPS netsetos.org colon a triple zero account login and here we got sign in with Facebook now when I click here it will authenticate with Facebook it will ask continue as netset os and here we got our I'll go to incognito mode and here I'll type HTTPS netsetos.org triple zero account login and here if you see the screen we got sign in with Facebook now when I click here here it is asking me to log into Facebook I'll give my email address and password and when I log in and here we got the login with the help of Netset OS. So this is how we can have Facebook login on our website. Now in the next video we will see how to log in with Twitter as well as with Google. So stay tuned and don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.